Hello and welcome to EC History in 60. Today's topic, the Buckland Opera House. At the northwest corner of Main and Harrison Streets, the Buckland Opera House opened in Elkhart in 1884. The 1,200-seat facility quickly became one of the top entertainment venues in the region. Some of the biggest in entertainment performed at the Buckland, including band leader John Philip Souza and magician Harry Houdini. In 1896, it was the first theater in the area to show a motion picture. In 1904, the third floor of the Opera House was home to Dr. Miles' Grand Dispensary, home to Dr. Frederick Miles' Physician Through Male Practice. After the dispensary closed in 1922, the Buckland was converted to a movie house and showed films until 1956. After 1956, the building was converted to have storefronts on the first floor, the second floor was home to a ballet school, and the third floor was used as a rehearsal hall for the Elkhart Symphony Orchestra. During the late 1970s and early 1980s, after years of neglect, there was fear that the roof would collapse. And after 102 years, the Buckland Opera House was demolished in 1986. Today, the location of the Buckland Opera House is a parking lot used by people as they visit downtown Elkhart. And that is your EC History in 60.